Hey guys, what up? It's your boy Danny Burke. <coughs> yeah, I thought. Huh, I thought I would try and see how that intro sounds. Doesn't really work, does it, when it comes from me? Anyway, I am here today to give you guys the top 10 life hacks you never knew existed. Some of these shortcuts we're going to talk about will save you precious seconds in your lives. And those seconds will add up eventually and give you even more time to get things done in your life. Such as watching videos like this on YouTube. Oh dear. But what have I done? Coming in at number 10, we have the freezing paper towel. Have you guys ever gone to drink a bottle or can of your favourite drink and it's warm? Yeah. It's annoying, isn't it? You have to put it in the fridge or freezer for ages to get it cool enough to actually enjoy it. Well, not anymore. All you have to do is get a wet paper towel, you wrap it around the outside of your drink and stick it in the freezer. After 15 minutes, the drink should be noticeably cooler. The freezer is very dry, which causes the water on the paper towel to evaporate quickly, which then drains energy from your drink, making it cooler very, very quickly. Next up at number nine, we have bouncing batteries. These days, you can get batteries that show you how much charge they have left in them, but a lot of them still really don't. So, how are you supposed to know when they are getting low on power? Well, see if they bounce. Seriously, drop a battery straight down onto a hard surface and if it doesn't bounce or only bounces a little bit, you're absolutely fine. If it flies up into the air, it's on its last legs. The sciencey reason for all of this is that the oxidization process inside the batteries turns the zinc gel into a sort of ceramic material which bridges the gaps between them. This turns into a network of very tiny miniature-like springs almost which make the battery bounce when it hits the floor. Okay, coming out number eight unroll the rim. Have you ever been at a fast food place and you want some ketchup but all they have are those tiny miniature paper cup things and you need like 10 of them just for you and your friends to have some ketchup? Well apparently we've all been doing it wrong because you're supposed to roll out the edges and expand the whole cup. That way they will reach their full ketchup carrying potential and I think that is a beautiful thing. Next up at number seven, airplane mode charging. Have you ever been in a rush to leave the house but your phone isn't charged. Maybe you have to leave in like 20 minutes, but your phone needs a lot longer than that. Well, here's the tip that has changed everything for me. Switch your phone to airplane mode. You can find that in the settings section of pretty much any phone out there. The downside is that airplane mode does cut out your phone signal, so you won't be able to text or call while you're doing this, but you can save yourself precious minutes in charging time. Moving on to number six, the hanging fork. Okay, some of you guys might be too young to ever have needed to hang a painting on a wall, but one day you will, and one day you will probably find that it can be quite Quite difficult at times to judge where the nail is behind the picture because you can't see it. Well, stick a fork on it, for real. Slide a fork down onto the nail so that it's now sticking up. Now use the fork to guide the painting and the string directly onto the nail. Once it's there, slide the fork right off again. This is one of my absolute favourite life hacks to be honest. I think this is what all forks were born to do in their lives, apart from the whole eating thing. Coming in at number five, the double microwave. Listen, in today's world, we don't have time, do we, to wait three minutes while someone else uses the microwave? Who wants to wait three minutes? I certainly don't. Okay, we should all be able to wait three minutes if we can, but check out this trick where you place a second bowl or small plate on top of a mug, taking advantage of all the extra space above the original thing that you wanted to microwave. Just be careful you don't spill it because cleaning out microwaves is never fun. Moving on to number four now, strawberry saver. I love the names that I've given these. Who loves strawberries? If you said no, have a word with yourself, mate. They're excellent fruit. The only downside to strawberry are the leaves on top of them. You have to pluck every single one off and if you don't do it in one clean movement, you could be picking away lots of tiny little bits of leaves to get rid of it all. Well next time, just stick a straw through the bottom of the strawberry and push up. This will quickly and cleanly remove all the leaves for you. This is actually why they're called strawberries because you're supposed to use a straw. I'm kidding, obviously. Or am I? No, I'm kidding. 
Coming in at number three, the sound booster. Okay, so when I was making this list, I was worried that too many people might have heard of this one. Maybe not though, and it could change someone's world. If you're playing music out of your phone and it's just too quiet, try putting it in a glass with the speaker at the bottom. This will help focus and direct the sound, making it noticeably louder. I didn't believe it at first, but now I have to do it every single time. All right, next up at number two, we have the egg test. If an egg looks like this, you know it's not good to eat. A lot of the time though, the outside of an egg shows no real signs of whether the inside has gone bad. Well, all you need is water. Drop an egg into a pot of water or your filled up sink. If the egg then sinks to the bottom and sits on its side, it's fresh. If it's starting to tilt towards the surface a bit, it's a week old. If it's upside down, it's pretty much stale. And if it actually floats, you need to chuck that thing out right now. That thing is old enough to lay its own eggs. Now this happens because air pockets build up inside the egg as the fluid evaporates through the shell. Science! And finally at number one, we have no ads in phone games. Phone games are great, aren't they? You know what's not great? adverts in phone games, specifically those pop-up banner adverts that interrupt your game constantly and ruin the experience for you. Well, for the second time in this video, airplane mode to the rescue. Switch your phone to airplane mode to stop any adverts from appearing in your games. This happens because the advert isn't stored on your phone or even in the game, it is sent over to it via the internet. Disabling your internet through airplane mode disables the ads. Well, hack me sideways, that was a life hack video. There are many more out there guys that I found on the internet but some of them looked a little bit too complicated and kind of ridiculous to be honest so I'm not sure if we should make a part two. I'll leave that decision with you guys as ever. Thank you for watching Most Amazing Top 10. My name is Danny Burke and I'll see you all in the next video.